guys, ladies and gentlemen. Here she is. Wow, these concepts are looking great, Kona. I like it already. You really have outdone yourself. This looks much more organized than we did fixing the suit. No wonder why there was a substantial part on your helmet. Well, we couldn't help it. We were on a ship. But wait, how can you fuse nanotech with titanium alloy? It doesn't matter. This universe breaks the laws of physics. We can do anything. I mean, you got a point. Something seems off about him. Why is he in underwear? Huh. huh. This place is pretty big for one guy alone. Who's there? Huh. I thought I heard someone there for a second. That's very funny of you. So let me get this straight. You had a nightmare about your house and your older sister. Found a trap and infected planet, took it, brought it into reality, and now you have teleportation powers. Yes, I've been through a lot, but I still stay strong. So what's that purple suit, dude? I'm sorry, who? Him? Hmm? You saw him too! I did! What did he do? Give you an offer? And I declined it! Well, I'm glad I'm not going insane! I thought I was for a second there! Wait, how did you see him? Well, I saw him in some VHS cameras I owe downstairs. I don't understand how that worked. What, is he the man behind the slaughter? Okay. What are you guys talking about? We'll explain later. Anyway, you said you got your powers from a nightmare. That means you must be one of them. Me? Yes. Can I see your eyes for a second? Sure. Hmm. Interesting. They're not orange. Is it okay I can take a blood sample from you so I can observe it? That's fine by me. But wait. How do we know we can trust you? What? You think I'm gonna make a cliche twist to betray you? That's unrealistic of you, Arthur. But <sighs> Interesting. The vast amount of electrons in your body creates more electricity than any other being. This is very abnormal. I'm surprised someone like you can handle this much energy. I'm surprised I didn't lose my sanity again for the past few days. Huh. So, by my observation, you are indeed one of those orange people guys. Interesting. You know, before we met you, I battled one myself. 
but oh, really. I need some help, and it was tough to deal with. So, that means you're the only one with a power source of your own, but the purple suit dude has multiple of them, so that explains why. Uh, guys? Have you seen Willow anywhere? No. Where is she? I, I don't know. Was she with you? What? No. I thought she was with us when I was... Oh, no, she didn't! What? situation, if you know what I mean. You, ma'am, are the definition of why society is going downhill. Come on! And besides, he already knows. What? Oh. I just thought you couldn't get any stupider. What are you, five years old? I did not give you permission to go down there. You could have gotten yourself killed, for goodness sake. Oh, oh, whoa, oh, what are you talking about? I was just exploring your lab. Then explain this, genius. Not only you were fighting the spider, you went through my stuff! I'm surprised you didn't go through my search history. That would have freaked you out. Alright, here's the gun. Look at this. Oh, great! Now one of my cameras is offline! Well, I must say, you're one heck of a fighter, but my god! No wonder why you're behind bars. Wait, let's rewind that real quick. This is why I installed cameras to keep an eye on the spider. It's a surprise, surprise! What do I see? You. Okay, I didn't know. I thought you were lying about an effect of being down there, despite so many theories about you betraying us. What? The people really think I was going to betray you guys? Well, she's right. The majority of the community thought you were going to pull a twist villain on us. I mean, I was a bit suspicious. Huh? What kind of weak plot device is that? That has got to be the stupidest thing I've ever heard of my life! And what do I do next? <laughs> yeah, you guys, now you think how you take care of the world. No, of course not! What do I do next? <laughs> yeah, you guys, now you think how you take care of the world. No, of course not! Kona and I had known each other for For years, Willow. He would never do such a thing like that. I know, I just had a weird vibe for some reason. You weren't lying. That spire knows how to take a beating. I told you! But it was not the first time. I've taken beatings that were way worse than that. Uh, you mean fighting? Yeah, I mean fighting. Oh. Also, why do you keep insulting me? I always said one thing to your robot. Says the convicted felony. I saw you all over the internet. Mugshots, records, Twitter. You know what you did wrong. I don't know if I can even trust you anymore. I'd rather kick you out and freeze to death than stay oh. here. Okay, Kona, calm down. She's still trying to make herself a better person. Just give her another chance. She didn't know. <sighs> You're right. I should have shown you guys the camera footage first to prove I wasn't lying before showing you guys the blueprints. I need a breather. Over hearing you guys about something- Anything else but that hat! Is this better? So much better, thank you. Okay. Anyway, I keep overhearing you guys talking about the spider, and I don't know why it seems so familiar to me. Is there something I should know about this person, or- Oh yeah. I was going to talk about that later, but I might as well do it now. This spider wasn't infected long ago. Wait, really? What happened? I actually met her in that temple. I, I didn't get to know her that well. It was a short period of time. But she was one of a kind. A pure soul. One of the nicest people I ever met. As I was exploring that place, I happened to meet her. It was terrifying at the first. She looked very alarmed, but I couldn't blame her due to the epidemic going around. While we were having a little combo, you know, she toured me around the place of how she protected herself, realizing this was her home, and I found it out of nowhere. Then, abruptly, an infected teleporter right in front of us. She told me to look out and walk for me. What George said, these orange peoples are a mystery. The spider lady told me they usually come with salt packs. I, I don't know, I have no words for them. After all that happened, 
I saw her there, injured. Checked up on her. She had a huge cut on her hand. She was infected. I, I didn't want to leave her, but she told me to go before she turned into one of them. If I had realized this sooner, it could have saved her. Kona, I'm so sorry. It's fine. PG Chow Films? Yes. Is she your daughter? What? I'm sorry. What? Is she your daughter? I need confirmation. I don't understand, Kona. Oh, right. The cameras. Here. <laughs> right there. Is that her? Kona? That's Idola. This can't be. I wish I could be lying to you right now. But this is the truth. How did you know this? She told me you're like a wish version of Iron Man or something. I don't know. Wait, you're a minor. How do you have a daughter? It's a long story. I can't believe this. Uh, okay, now don't get too sad, Brickman. Man up. You're not the only one who lost a loved one. Come on, we'll all at least be considerate. Give us some time. Right. Sorry. Look, I know it's hard for you right now. But you have to clear the path for us. But I don't want to fight her, Pony. She's my daughter. Same here. If I confronted Sissy Infected, I wouldn't want to fight her either. But I would have no choice. This is why we're getting the cure. To save others we lost. You guys helped me get over William. Now you should do the same thing too. Just remember, you're not alone in this. You're right. I have to stop her from blocking our path for all of us. Sorry, I just got traumatized there for a moment. Now that's the spirit. Fair warning, she's very strong. Why'd she go down there? For a very stupid reason. It feels like I'm reading a fanfic in here. Also, where's your suit? You're gonna need it. I already disabled it for Kona to upgrade. Then that defeats the whole purpose of you going down there. You need your suit to protect yourself, which I is why you'll need an extra hand. Eh, fair enough. Plus saved. Maybe. Wait, wait. Lego, have this. What is this? I used George's blood sample and reverse engineered to turn into a potion. There's a chance we'll stun her, do something else, or it won't work at all whatsoever. Are you kidding me? I'm not giving this to her! Don't we know if this is harmful or not? You literally shot an effect before and they all killed in 20 seconds. Yeah, good point. Good luck out there, you two. Hope she doesn't blow you away. <laughs> get it? Because we're the blizzard? Yes, we get it. Your jokes are very funny, Kona. Now, you will go downstairs first and clear the path for the rest of the group. Sounds good. How hard can it be? Wow, this is quite a big lab for a single person. It is, but we gotta focus. The faster we get done, the more time you guys get. I know, but look at all of this. Your friend must have a lot of time on his hands, doesn't he? Sir, I am programmed to protect, not have long conversations like you. Well, that's very rude of you. I'm trying to line up the spirit after what I saw, unfortunately. Say, what do you guys do for your spare time? <sighs> Why don't we have any mouths? He talks a lot about what's outside our world, game mechanics, you know, a lot of things. Oh, trust me, you don't want to know what our world is like. Where's the name of fiction? <sighs> like, for example, that thing. You in underwear. I want to punch this computer so bad. But you know, a wise one once told me, don't let the simple things get to you. Fire and fire will just create more fire. This running gag's old anyway, forget it.
guess we're in a sticky situation, aren't we? This is no time for jokes. My abilities are compromised now, and they're the spider that put it in us! Should I use the potion? It's the only thing we have! Well, at least it's better than nothing! Good to see you too. Can you can you put us down, please? <laughs> I think I just broke a man. Where are your microphone oh. settings? Anyway, here's the milk. So, that's your daughter, huh? Yep, she is. <laughs> I thought Kona was going insane there when he told me. But it turns out I was wrong about it. Hi. Also, can you talk? Oh, I'm sorry about that. I just realized, you're so infected. Why are we so calm about this? Well, my databases show she's not a threat, so I think we're all good. Question. If she's your daughter, then does that mean- I'm gonna stop you right there. She's adopted. Oh, okay. Wait, no! This is so bizarre to me! How'd you two even meet in the first place? Origin story or real life based? Real life. My systems are burning to know what actually happened. Alright, if you say so. I don't know how I'm going to execute this. But it's gonna get wild! <laughs> and filler. It was back in April 2021. While I was scrolling through Twitter, I got a DM from Agent asking me this. You think I'm just gonna post a screenshot of it, huh? Here, I'll make this interesting. Uh, hi, Maytune. Did you need me here? ETS, you're my savior. Oh, hi. Uh, yeah, uh, so I have a question for you. Do you use Roblox Studio to animate your stuff? Yes, I do. Well, then that's great! If that's the case, how would you like to work for Piggy? I've seen your films, and I am astonished by your work. May tune my films suck, but I appreciate the compliment. You know, I always want to animate some stuff for you. It is my dream to work for Piggy. The thing is, I always have a very tight schedule when it comes to having a YouTube channel, and since I post videos daily, and I have real-life stuff to work on as well, so I don't know if I can. I'll come back to you when I have the time. Sure, take your time. Fast forward to July 2021, Maytune posted a few teasers of Chapter 10, and at that moment, it was my time to step in. Oh, hey, you're back. Yes, hi again. It's been a while, and now I have finally decided. Is it okay I can animate a skin for you in this chapter? Oh, sure. Are you sure you want to animate this one? It's quite complicated. I am willing to do anything. Like that time I beat you in Connect 4 a few days ago. Zip it, you. Okay, I'll send it to you on Discord. Here's a list of things you have to animate. The idle, walk, jump, and jump scare animation. Make sure the time frame of the jump scare hit is 0.5 seconds. Have fun! I have arachnophobia. After that, I got to work. I provided everything for her. I was a bit confused about the jump animation, but I got the gist of it. And there's this one time she drew me a picture of me with her. Pretty cool. And then I gave it back to Maytune. Ah, oh, thank you so much, Lego. It was nice doing business with you. It was nice doing business with you too, Maytune. Alright, let me put this into my computer real quick. Oh, by the way, is it okay I can make a marketing strategy to hype the community for this chapter? Like, the purple hat thing you posted? Yeah, sure, just not the purple hat. That one is a personal secret for me. Okay, that makes sense. I'm gonna trick people into thinking it's funny. I swear, I did not know Bunny was gonna be there anyway. After all that happened, I decided to make codes all around my videos so people could decode what it meant. And it was, it's not Halloween, but, and I think the plan worked. Lots were clueless, many were skeptical, few were questionable. And then the chapter came out. I had really fun making it. You know, this artwork was supposed to be a gift, but the pink community came in and- In the case of one-year-old Spidella, PGHL Films, you are the father. This is very illegal. It really is. And that's how it happened. It's a lot. Someone give me the holy water. I want a short circuit. Hey, Kona. How's the suit upgrade going? 
Oh, hey. Oh, whoa! It's going really good so far. Now, that is cool! Uh-huh. It's impressive, isn't it? It's a good thing that Blender software exists. That thing is a lifesaver. Oh, yeah, Kona. Yeah. I've been wondering. What is that thing? Oh, that? That's a teleportation chamber. I used the infected's power source and re-engineered it into a teleportation device. It's similar to yours. You can take a look at it. Just make sure not to break anything. Okay. Sleep paralysis demon again?